Hey everyone, I thought it would be fun to do a little video of some of the things that are in my yard that are visually interesting during this bone dry September where we've had no rain at all. So there were these white flowers, they were called Virgin's Bower, I believe. Well, first of all, this thing is just, everything is dry as a bone. But Virgin's Bower, I believe it was called, they had these beautiful white flowers and it grew practically everywhere out here. Well, if you look at it now, you can see pretty clearly that it has become this uh, cottony seed covered thing instead. All the flowers are gone and now we have this fibrous cotton bean sprout looking deal going on. And there's tons of it. All of this stuff that you see here that looks kind of, I don't know, shaggy? right here over there it's just it's everywhere it's it's like permeating the place it's there it's here and there's a metric ton of the stuff right here i mean a ton of it uh, i need to get rid of this stupid flower bed but everything's so dry i can't burn it off and get rid of it i don't know what this is but i'm sure it's a horrific weed it basically sprung up overnight one day because I didn't even notice it until it had exploded. But uh, it's got a cool cottony puff ball here at the top. It's probably ragweed or something equally terrifying, you know. But anyway, so that's a thing. Let's see what else. Oh uh, yeah, there's even more of that junk over here closer to the actual house, roses. Somehow, I haven't slaughtered these rose bushes yet. I mean, of all the things, you'd think I would have probably killed these first. But they're beautiful. They're absolutely beautiful. Even more beautiful if I focus on them. Very nice cluster of them here. They smell great. I mean, they smell really great. I do rather enjoy the way that these roses smell right now and I kind of want to stay over here every time I come and look <sighs> oh no I'm covered in those furry things it'll be all right but yeah beautiful roses very nice very nice roses That's my disturbing bathroom window with the gimpy screen. So, I get to look at those. <clears throat> Another rose bush here. I lost a rose. And there's a lot more of that virgin's bower flower here. Well, seed now. And then there is still one rose that's about to bloom here. And get nice and pretty for me before things get worse. I need to get that tree out of there. Uh, moving on, the horror that is this window, there's a nice wasp nest right there. And you're probably saying, hey, don't get that close. Now they see me, and I'm going to walk away now. But paper wasps are not that aggressive. And then, down here, the best thing that I can show you, these beautiful things are called surprise lilies. They practically spring up overnight. We had a very small batch of these right here last year just appear out of nowhere. I mean, like, literally, they just come out of nowhere. You don't even see them growing, and then one day there's these red flowers in your backyard, and you have no idea why. But they're absolutely gorgeous. And I'm really excited to share them with you. And that's all the cool stuff in my backyard. There's really nothing else that's cool over here. Uh, well, 
There is a frontal spider web down here, but you might have a hard time actually seeing it. Have a good one.